All right, in the car, getting ready to go. And that'd be cool if I turn my headlights on. All right, I already got a ticket for that once. It's a long story. Um, okay, so here's here's a couple things that pissed me off, and uh, I think it's kind of humorous. I'm about to be mean. So anybody that doesn't like when I'm mean, which I kind of have been this whole time, so you can go fuck yourself. I'm um, just kidding. Uh, I like my friends. Still, uh, still be my friend, please. Um, no, but I'm about to be mean, so deal with it. Um, so like I'm in there and I'm getting ready to get some candy or whatever, and you know, there's four like little gangster bitches, as I like to call them. Um, I won't, I won't bring uh, race into this because that would be racist. And that's not what I'm going for. I'm going for, um, well, I'm, I'm trying to go for racism, but I'm trying to make it incognito. So, not really. I'm not racist. I'm American. <laughs> so, anyway, um, <clears throat> you know, I'm, I'm chilling, chilling in the aisle, getting ready to fucking get some candy. And, like, four gangster bitches come up. And I think it's funny because, like, they talk shit while you're, I don't know, like, a foot or two away. And I'm like, really, dude? Like, I can see over your head at the sprees I didn't buy. I'm not going to fight you. I'm going to burp you and put you back in your stroller. Like, that's... Fuck. Come on. Let's be real. And then and then the next thing is... Like, uh, I don't know if I have, like, a mask on my face that says, please look at me like a douche. But um, apparently I do. Didn't notice. Um, <clears throat> but there's a fat guy, you know... No offense to fat people out there. It happens. Twinkies happen. They just go in your mouth. I don't know what the fuck. They're like, it's like water. Um, not really. Get on the treadmill, you sons of bitches. Um, so anyway, this dude's looking at me like I just fucking stole his plate of spaghetti. And I'm like, dude, really? Like, fucking, I'm just walking. Just, I learned to do this when I was three. No, probably two. I don't know. I don't want to sound cooler than I am. Um, but no, I'm just fucking walking. And, like, he's giving me the dirtiest, crustiest fucking look. Like, seriously, dude, do you not realize that I'm buying candy and fucking Oreos? Oh, I got Oreos, by the way. Yep. So, anyway, I got candy and Oreos. Like, you don't realize that this is bait for you? Like, if you start shit with me, I will lure you into a narrow space, kick you into it, and you will die there. That's where you will live. Because you can't get out. I don't care. Um, so yeah, I mean, that, that kind of pissed me off. And then, you know, kind of long drawn out rant here. Fucking, I'm in the 20 items or less, Deucey. I realize what you're talking about now. If you're watching this video, if not, then go fuck yourself very much. Um, <clears throat> I'm sitting there in the fucking 20 items or less aisle. And there's a fucking larger than life lady chilling there with like fucking at least 150 items in her basket I'm sitting there with three cashier guy says hey I'm gonna go get some cigarettes there's no other cashiers except for me and I'm like yo excuse me man would you mind if I just checked out real quick and um to my dismay she's like no I was here first and I'm like really like I, and honestly I didn't really care I was like you know it's fine that's fine um but when you give me a crusty look after I ask the question and your chin disappears and turns into two, I'm not letting that go. No, nope, no way. I'm not letting that go. So, but he said that there was a cashier in electronics. So, you know, I have kneecaps that you can visibly, visibly see. Yeah, I fucked up. Don't, don't judge me. I can, that you can visibly see. So I walked my happy ass over there to electronics and got my shit checked out. Little did I know that one comment was going to ignite my life. Um, I said, wow, you guys really need uh, some more cashiers, huh? Guy goes, no, no, uh, there's not a lot of people that come at, at 3 o'clock in the morning. Statistics have been done. And I'm like, oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know you were the fucking accountant of Walmart. I just saw you stalking, <laughs> stalking fucking movies there, Leroy fucking Jenkins. Jesus. So I'm just like, okay, cool. So I guess everybody's a fucking douche at 3 o'clock in the morning. And let's keep in mind that they're all sober. So, I mean, at least they're not half naked wanting to fight and fucking pissing on sidewalks. Um, <clears throat> so I got my shit and I left. And then I walked to my car and made this video. So that was my night.
Hopefully you guys had a great time. I'm almost home here. I'm going to fucking eat some candy and eat some Oreos, play some Star Wars, The Old Republic, like a fucking cool guy. Don't pretend like you motherfuckers are not impressed with what I just said. All right? This is the fucking ninja signing off.